welcome this is the energy vibration uh, reading for uh, the Aries Sun Moon horizon sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back <laughs> my cards is all over the place it is a week of uh, love is coming in new love is coming in for you guys if you're pregnant your baby might be born in this week some of you could be finding out that you're also pregnant okay um yeah some of you are going to be finding out that you're also pregnant okay so week is the third week of um uh it's the third week of um august let's see what's happening for you aries okay there is something that flips out okay let's see what's happening for the aries sun moon horizon sign okay you have an issue with an organization and you're asking for forgiveness okay the truth came out about something that you Aries have done and uh, um, you're having an issue with an organization and you're asking for forgiveness now whatever that has happened whatever that has transpired for you Aries um, you're asking for forgiveness information is coming out about something that you have done the wheel of fortune this is a karmatic issue so um, definitely you're dealing with a karmatic issue the truth is coming out it's like an organization see exactly that what was happening for you Aries okay and it's all about money um, and being with um, someone else okay um, and whatever the issue is and the situation is for you Aries I'm seeing some of you asking for forgiveness from organization okay because um, it's as if an organization find out that you have done some deceptive situation and you are asking for forgiveness it has to do with money organization could find out that you have stole some money and um, you Aries whatever the information is okay you guys just keep on flipping out okay so it's like everything is in reverse okay the family is in reverse with you Aries um, also the truth is coming out lies and deception jealousy um, Wow the night of ones you young people especially is dealing with a situation with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, the night of ones you people are dealing with a situation oh some lies and deceptiveness okay what is the center for the Aries uh, for this week okay it has to do with a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn so some of you if you have a child that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn there is some issue with this young person okay whatever the issue is there is a definitely some issue with this young person if you have a child that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn there is some issues okay and it's coming up in the family you men um, have to ask for forgiveness from an organization they have found out that you have done some injustice and you men 45 years and older you're in the reverse whatever you have done is coming out an organization is going to be um, stepping in and you could be asking for forgiveness for what you have done okay um, you have done some lies and deception so you men 45 years and older have done some lies and deception and the organization found out what you have done okay alrighty so um, an healing needs to happen the healing isn't here there's a lot of major arcana and there is uh, where some of you need to call upon your angels and guides I'm seeing you younger people there is no win-win situation for you younger people um, you have done some injustice against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn there is no win-win situation for you um, there is a race with you and the family you younger people um, I'm seeing a situation with a Taurus a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn some of you could have done something to your sister that is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn I'm seeing no um, 
It says if you're in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and you want um, a new start you're waiting for an offer or you're waiting for answer from this person it's going to be um, it's not going to be I'm seeing some deceptiveness that is um, happening if you're in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion I'm seeing that there is a lot of jealousy there's jealousy that is going on um, there so you got to be aware now the two major arcana some of you are having issues with a Virgo and a Gemini some of you are having issues with a Virgo and a Gemini okay there is definitely family issues that is going on and it has to do with sisters and brother um, that you're fighting against each other sisters and brother and that you're fighting against each other okay whatever this issue is whatever that is transpired this is going to be coming up now if your father is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion or you're in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or scorpion I'm seeing a lot of jealousy that is coming out so let's see young people you, you need a lot of healing whatever is happening lies oh god you young people there is so much lies may God help you yes and the secrets are coming out so for you young people there's so much lies and the secrets are coming out your secrets is about to land there is so much lies you young people between the age of 18 and 45 oh my god your lies are coming out lies about the night that the, the this queen of pentacles you have done something to the queen of pentacles this is a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn lied about this woman lied about this woman you have to pay this woman a lot of money okay you have to pay this woman a lot of money you have lied and deceived this woman a lot of money and you have to pay this woman and return the stuff you stolen from this person okay lies you have stolen from this uh, lady she's really a lady she's a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn you have lied and the secrets and lies is here and it's all coming out you have to return the stuff that you took from this person okay you can't stand your ground over this person because this person really takes you down I think it's an issue where you were dealing with uh, some of you were working in a company um, and uh, at work you stole some stuff from a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and the lady you have deceived the lady of her personal things and so and you have to return it because you're going to be caught and sent to jail um, here again it's a seven of pen with, with a family there is family issue that is going on there is no there is no you have to make a decision with this family issue that is going on okay um, between you and, and and a sibling this person is a Taurus Virgo a Capricorn is a sister or a brother there is a family issue that is going on it needs to be resolved and it's all caused by this man this man who is a it was an Aries um, um, 45 years and older you have done some injustice and create illusions and now um, you are being caught okay the knight of cups is coming in this is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and it's all because of uh, um, jealousy jealousy deceptiveness the seven of swords the, the the knight of cups try to do something deceptive and it is um, going to be um, art breaks Outbreaks, this outbreaks of deception um, is here, and it has to do with the a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. But whoever this younger man is is working with you, um, men, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You both are going to be caught. Okay, you have done something. Good news is going to is not coming in for you guys. So you, you Aries are not having any good news because whatever you have done, um, yes, um, six. And to eight. Um, some of you, if you were in a relationship with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, this person, there is no, no new love that is coming in. This person, whatever has transpired, some of you were dealing with a young Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. There is heartbreak. There's deceptiveness. There's jealousy. 
um, and deceptiveness whatever that was transpiring there is jealousy and deceptiveness now you men 45 years and older came up in your reading okay you came up in your reading there is so much lies and deceptiveness that has been transpiring with you older men five 45 years and older and it has to do with the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn whether this lady is you have tried to deceive this lady in so many way and there is that you fall in your own trap okay so you men 45 years and older for the rest of you guys it's going to be a beautiful week there is going to be healing that is coming up for the people between the age of 18 and 45 the lies and the deception is going to be coming out so you have to be aware of that and there's no good news that is coming in for you people between the age of 18 and 45 the lies and deceptiveness that you have created around a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman this is all coming out the truth is going to be coming out in this week family is in reverse and I'm seeing here the itch you guys have the itch in this week the itch number 38 heal the itch heal the itch this is what you guys have in this week it's about healing the itch and now whatever the secrets and the lies and deception that was going on it's all coming out it's about healing the itch this is number 11 and there is going to be a lot of art breaks it's like there is like a lot of reverse situation because um, a lot of you were working with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion this is just deceptive move that has made the secrets that you have created against um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn lady the lies and deception these are all coming out and this is showing up uh, don't expect any good news because there is just so much lies and deception um, that you guys are um, sharing and you know and whoever this um, young person is um, some of you men have created a situation with a young person, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn, and this is all coming out. And I'm seeing some deceptive move with a younger person. So it could be a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. It's just, it's a week where sisters and brothers, people's issues, relationship with the with the with the Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, heartbreak. Um, for the Pisces cancer or scorpion there's so much deceptiveness and deceptive situation that has been transpiring that is coming up it's a week of the ish I want to say to you guys you know try and resolve this situation whatever is transpiring namaste until next time